YouTube, what's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video with your boy, Ensman Shadow. You might be thinking, Shadow, what video are we reacting to today? Well, we are going to react to 28 secret references in video games. This video right here is made by, it's made by Top 5 Gaming. There will be a link down below, go and check out uh, his work and so on to support. So we're just gonna go ahead and get right into the video. Be sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you're brand new, hit that little bell. Share this with a friend who likes secret references and other games in general, and maybe they will enjoy this video as well. Let's get into it. Fallout 4 has a terminal that contains a secret reference. Three ramps, ladders to climb, and a boss at the top throwing obstacles. Wait, is yes, that the developers Mario? recreated OG Donkey Kong and Mario. Yeah. And while playing Dying Light 2, you can find this strange looking fungus. Turns out you can interact with it, and pressing it enough times teleports you here. Is this Last of Us or something? What am I looking at? If you guessed the Harry Potter Quidditch oh, reference, you'd be Potter. correct. But sort of. In the description, it's called Dish Quid. Oh. There are so many locations in House Flipper that you would never expect one of them to be a horror movie. You could be scrolling through the list only to find the Myers residence. Okay, maybe a oh, coincidence, Michael right? Oh, Michael Myers. Uh, I think that's the wrong movie, but this no. also changes every what? time you look away. <laughs> but the weirdest part happens when you work on the yard because Michael is stalking you. Now, if wow, you steal a bucket no in Goat Simulator 3 and collect a bunch of sand, you can eventually build your own giant sand castle. This thing is huge. But stepping inside Fish. is not what you'd expect. Instead, it's a complete replica of Dust 2 from CSGO. A little detail to appreciate are the ridiculous enemy names like Alessandro and Santa Claus. In the low Santa gravity Claus. area of postal brain damage, you can fly upwards until you're greeted by a screen. Hello. Not this Trust me, time, you do my not friend. want to take no for an answer. When you reach the final screen, you can phase right through it, and your reward is Doom Slayer's butt cheeks. Huh? Those moronic developers <laughs> thought they could hide this from me? Dude, what? If the Sarah cleaned up details over level, game. you can what? head behind the greenhouse and find a suspiciously familiar lever. So what now? Well, you gotta search around the entire map looking for something to dig until you find one rock that works. <laughs> that's There's even an iron pickaxe for grabs. Nice. One cave you don't nice. want to explore is in Chivalry 2. If you expected a dragon or something to come out and attack you, you guessed wrong. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I know that reference. This is the same evil bunny from Minecraft, but technically they're both a reference to Monty Python. Jesus oh Christ! My God. I warned you! Some Easter I eggs are here to distract you. you from developers' embarrassing mistakes. In Cyberpunk, NPCs were super broken and just kept running into this wall. Spare change. So, Air instead change. of fixing the issue, the devs added a giant blood stain and a sign for platform nine and three quarters. And now the NPCs try to get to Hogwarts. <laughs> Fun fact, there's also a faded six on the wall making this platform 69 and three quarters. They couldn't okay, resist. Dude. Neither could the devs of Jazz Punk. Hidden in the telescopes, you'll find yourself in the opening scene of James Bond. Bond. James Bond. While you're swimming around in Duke Nukem Forever, you can find a pocket of air with the head of an iconic character. Duke even expresses jealousy for how much better their game turned out. Well, at least he got an ending. At least he got cleanup, an you ending. You gotta clean this place by throwing trash into a giant monster's mouth. Ugh. Fans of Star Wars will instantly recognize this as the Sarlacc pit, which is already cool, but once you throw enough garbage down here... A lightsaber? Okay, that's actually really sick. In Mr. Hobbs Playhouse 3, this statue has a hidden button behind it, unlocking a room that transports you to a whole other world. Sonic? Zelda? If the Sonic fans weren't already creeped out, the plate even spins. If you explore Shadow Warrior's caves for long enough, this stone wall leads you to an underground lake. Interesting. The whole place is taken <clears throat> directly from the Half-Blood Prince. There's the boat, Drink of Despair, and even Dumbledore's wand, all to get a Horcrux. Oh. Well, let's just say Kratos would appreciate this tribute in Borderlands 3. In the Tazandir ruins, you can find a random wooden boat, which seems innocent until you get closer. Is that supposed to be Mimir? Okay, it's pretty gross, but yeah, don't worry. Is. This is a reference to Mimir from God of War. 
It's extra heartwarming when devs look back on their own games. Battlefield 3 has a building which seems pretty empty, but stick around for a while and you'll find a secret. That Fans of Mirror's Edge will instantly yeah. recognize who owns them, Faith. Both of these games are made by DICE, so naturally they would want to pay tribute to their passion project. If in fact, Mirror they love Edge it so much that they've hit these shoes in VR. almost every edition of Battlefield, like on top of a crane in 2042. Not the only secret in the sky. Riders Republic will take you all the way to an airport control tower to find one. On the roof, you can spot a wooden ramp, which seems pretty strange, but just stand on it for a while and... Oh, that's pretty cool. Wait a minute. If you're getting deja vu, there's even a hay bale at the bottom, so you can take a leap of faith. If you know, you know. While playing Deus Ex, you might come across this antique store, but head down to the basement and you'll find its most valuable item. Oh, portal reference. You're rude to call this an antique, though. Assassin's Creed Odyssey has probably the most subtle reference I've ever seen near this waterfall. Seems pretty normal until you call your bird for a better view. Wakanda. Any fan of Black Panther will immediately yeah, know this as the coronation yeah. scene from the movie. Even yeah. the tribes are wearing different colored robes. Another unexpected secret is in the Talos Principle, where you can jump down a cliff and find this small cave entrance. I got his glow to it. It's hidden cave. <laughs> and there it is. We've got. Serious Han Solo, song. dude. You'd expect Han Solo to be frozen in here, but this time the devs decided to change it up with a double reference, freezing their oh. iconic character, Serious Sam, instead. There's also a ridiculous cameo in Borderlands 3. As you're completing bounty missions, there's a chance you'll get to take out Wick and Warty. Yeah, those guys. Hey, I need a new Warty. Still not as insane as The Witcher 3 changing the ending of your favorite show. In one of the DLC quests, there's a prison overlooking the ocean, but wait until you get your hands on the key. This exact situation happened to Tyrion Lannister from Game of Thrones, except unlike Tyrion, this dwarf's kinda dead. Oof. Nice idea for a prison without bars. Shame he didn't know how to fly. In a game like Cyberpunk, it's easy to look at something like paper origami and just probably ignore it. Well, after taking the elevator to the terrace, people explored the rooftop and found this unknown NPC sitting with a bird. Okay, now the dots are starting to connect. The origami is from Blade Runner, which also explains uh, the whole, you know, dead bird thing. Oof. They don't just make serious this. Easter eggs, one of them is a hilarious throwback. There's a train tunnel and right at the entrance, you'll find a crime scene. If their names make you smirk, you probably get it, but if not, check out this conversation before the accident. Yeah, oh it's probably one God. of the most famous lines in gaming. All we had to do Dude, was follow the, the damn train, train CJ. CJ. In Dying Light, players discovered a crazy secret hiding on the rooftops. They're full of chimneys, but one of them is in a green pipe belonging to an old friend. That's actually pretty cool. Way! It doesn't stop there. Halfway through, there's a free item waiting for you. Yes, the devs are fans of Mario's Tanuki suit. Now let's be honest, the first place you'd expect to find a horror movie is in Zombie Army 4. Oh. Like, come on, we all know who these guys are. Yep. Play with us, Daddy. If that didn't make you feel uneasy, maybe Battlefield 5 will. In the jungle, Kenai players saw a strange splatter on the leaves. Oh. Yep. That predator. sound is way too familiar. It's the predator stalking you, and now the green splatter makes sense. It's his glowing blood. Did you know, in the uncertain, most players don't realize you could just ignore your objective. When it asks you to find an informant, just venture down this dark alleyway instead. I know it kind of seems like a bad idea, but just wait until you open up the dumpster. Eh, that someone left behind Clementine's hat from Telltale's Walking oh Dead. My God, Most I'm players will miss that, but everyone can identify the hat in Nine Child Street. As you're exploring the house, head to the children's bedroom to find a cab you will definitely recognize. There's Ash Ketchum. Not sure what Ash Ketchum is doing here, but that's part two of secret references hidden in video games. It's been Tommy, and keep it here on T5G. <laughs> that was actually really good. All right, guys, that's going to go ahead and be the end of this video. Hope you guys have an amazing rest of your week. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.